Residential life at Barnard is about creating community. We're here to support our students in navigating what this experience will be and creating their new home away from home. Living on campus has been so phenomenal. The quad is really tightly knit, which actually makes it super easy to socialize. You literally never have to leave your dorm. You can just walk down the hall and you're right with your friends already. The quad in itself is like a home, and then you can just go outside and you're in New York City. But at the same time, if you don't want that experience of being in a big city, you still have Barnard and Columbia's campus, which is like its own little thing. You're super close to the dining hall, you're super close to the library, you're close to a lot of your classes, and you're close to your friends. So there's a really nice communal aspect to it that I think makes the transition a lot easier. We train our staff knowing that the first six weeks of being in a new environment are really scary and really crucial to your involvement in the community long term. So we really hone in on those first six weeks to provide additional support, additional programming, additional opportunities to get you involved. An RA is just a residential advisor. It's usually an older student for first years and she lives on the floor and you can just go and talk to her if you're having a bad day or if you're having roommate issues or if you need help registering for classes or don't know what resources to have. And and she's just great about checking in and making sure we're okay. Being so far away from home, it took a lot to adjust to New York City and to Barnard in general and to college. So I really wanted to help other students feel comfortable in exploring new options and opportunities here at Barnard. Being at any dorm in Barnard, it's gonna be like a giant sleepover because all of them are women and they're your friends and it's just a very supportive environment. For students thinking about coming here to Barnard, you can expect a community that's always ready and prepared to help you figure out what you need and feel at home. After the first year, students can choose more independently what they're looking to have in a living experience. We have our students who choose to stay in the quad for proximity or close to lab or other things that they may need, but we have lots of students who may choose that they want to live closer to Central Park or may want to choose to live a little bit further down Broadway or on Amsterdam. All these different parts of New York City offer a different sense of community and our students really have an opportunity to decide what works for them. Well, the benefit of living on campus versus living um, anywhere else in New York City in an apartment with a landlord is definitely a sense of security and a, an additional layer of support when you live in a residence hall as part of a college setting. From living in the quad here in my first year and then being an RA for seniors in the tower, I felt like I've been able to create lifelong relationships and friendships with the people that I live around here at Barnard.